Hey, so it's Ross Gilbert from Solid State Logic here at Infocom 2022. Welcome to our booth. Uh, we've got lots and lots of new products to show you, including the uh, brand new Big Six Super Analog Mixer and USB interface. I'm going to give you a little rundown of some of its features and why it's a, an amazing product. So. Super Analog, it's a design platform taken from our 9000 series consoles. Um, what it means is uh, super wide gain range, super low distortion, and it gives you great headroom, super wide punchy sound, that kind of classic SSL sound. The first four channels on this console offer Super Analog mic pre's with uh, line input and high Z input for di DIing guitars and so on, and you've got 48V phantom power and an analog high pass filter built into it. As we go down the channel strip, so we've got the, uh, the super analog gain here. It, at the top you can notice you can flip each channel to look at the USB input or you can run it in uh, traditional analog mode. And as we go down you've got stereo Q1 with a pan as well. Stereo Q2 again a pan. In the middle here you can see on all channels we've got a three band E-series style EQ with dedicated high and low shelves with bell curve attenuation and also a dedicated mid-range. As we go further down you've got the pan control for the channel and on, as you can see on the first four super analog channels you've also got our legendary channel compressors. Um, they have program dependent attack and release characteristics so they're great for smoothing vocals, nibbling at hi-hats, generally giving you that kind of well-produced sound. As you go further down the console we have four stereo inputs or dual mono um, so you don't eat up faders if you've got mono sources and as you go to the far right we've got a very comprehensive monitoring section with big monitors, little monitors, dim, cut uh, and your mono as well. Um, on top of that we've got dual independent headphone outputs and this is the really cool bit. So for the first 12 inputs, they're, 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 they're the first 12 USB inputs and outputs. The latter four you can reroute to depending on what the production requires. So you could route them to the stereo Q sends, you could route them to the external inputs that you could see at the top, you can route them to headphone inputs and outputs. So really flexible unit, production workhorse, and a massive sort of Swiss army knife of a production tool. So, thanks for listening. Uh, if you want to find out more, www.solidstatelogic.com.